all right guys so i just pulled up at party city because my baby's birthday is next week he will be seven years old so i'm just getting ready to run in here and order his balloons really quick just to get that out of the way and then look around a little bit and see what else i may want to pick up for him but yeah then i have a nail appointment um i'm going to get a pedicure and just relax or at least try to relax um for an hour <laughs> that's about it um it's just a little afternoon right now so i'll probably grab something quick to eat before I go and get my pedicure. But yeah, that's what I am getting ready to do now. So let's go ahead. My phone. Yeah, I'm doing good on time. So let's go ahead and run in Party City. And then we'll go from there. All right, guys, so I am now here at the nail salon. I'm early, so I'm just sitting here replying to some comments. Um, I uploaded my Petal and Pup dress haul try on video today. Um, I'm actually wearing the pink one um, today, and I'm just replying to those comments. Oh, yesterday. I went to Target and picked up the um, Airwick Essential Oil Mist little thingy um, to try out this hack that I got from my girl Sharika B uh, here on YouTube. Um, she did a TikTok. Um, hack and I thought it was so cool so I wanted to try it out um, so I went to my Target and got that yesterday so I will insert that clip here for you guys now so you can see so this is influenced by her it's this Airwick hack I don't even know what it's called but it looked really really cool it's the um, Airwick essential mist diffuser and the hack is that you can use the Bath and Body Works wallflowers um, in this little machine here. I got, I think, two mahogany teakwood intensity. I got, I got the stress relief eucalyptus and peppermint linen lavender. Mahogany Teakwood, Warm and Comforting. Yeah, this is the other high intensity Mahogany Teakwood, which is my favorite. Uh, another Mahogany Teakwood. I'm waiting on the um, Marshmallow Fireside to come out. And then I got the Lavender Bergamot. So I think I'm gonna try this out with the lavender bergamot and now and show you guys if it works if it works i'll link the little doohickey here for you guys um but yeah so i'll go ahead and share that hold on all right so let's go ahead and get this open all right so here's the little oil that comes with it but we're not going to use this and she said it comes with batteries so let's see. Oh, yep. Yeah. Alright, so I just opened it. It does come with three batteries. Take our lavender bergamot. Okay. 
guys see it? So cool. So it definitely works. So I will put a link to this below for you guys. It comes in black and white. And yeah, such a cool little hack. So yeah, how cool is that? Now I wanna get another one. Like I wanna get a second one, like for the bedroom maybe, I don't know. But so cool. Like I'm not on TikTok, but every time she shares something that she um, finds on TikTok, I'm always so intrigued. So definitely go check her out. I'll leave her information below because she's like TikTok queen. <laughs> she does all the cool TikTok stuff. I am just not that cool. Um, but I was like sharing with you guys. So definitely check her out. I'm just getting ready to go in here now and get my pedicure. I think I'm just gonna keep it neutral on the toes today because that seems to work well for me and yeah so let's go all right everyone so it is like a couple days later and we're just getting ready for swim class and uh we got to go to the grocery store um i also need to go to h m i had got something a couple pairs of jeans and they don't fit we need to go up a size um it's crazy how much he's grown this summer so we're gonna do that and i'll probably look around a little bit in there when i went last week they didn't have anything but the workers were like putting out stuff so i don't know if they were doing like a restock when i was in there and they kind of cleared everything out but it was slim picking so i'm hoping when we um go in today they have some stuff but yeah that's pretty much what's on the agenda for today so we're gonna go ahead and head out. Hey, Cole. You like those? I like the black ones with the fur. All right, guys, so back home now. Got a hot mess going on here, but I'm trying to get a little bit organized here. So this is the insert that I'm gonna be using for the diaper bag. Basically, this is gonna be zero to three months. So yeah, I've basically just been putting things in here as I get them, and um, I did get him a new, little pacifier holder can you guys tell that i'm like really want my baby to take a pacifier <laughs> which is crazy um but i found a black one and i also got him some black pacifiers other moms have raved about these um bibs pacifiers so i'm gonna give them a try <laughs> so yeah got that and just been adding little things these are some little honest diapers that i got um, as gifts for my baby shower and just got a little swaddle blanket in here some wet ones a mask of course some wipes this is just a bottle um, I am planning to nurse but I still just put a bottle in there just in case um, because I will be pumping as well got some hand sanitizer here some change of clothes. This is just a little outfit and onesie. What's this? Burp cloth and bibs. So it's slowly coming together, but the insert is from Owl Bags. I'll leave them linked below. They're on Etsy. Um, 
and I basically reached out to them. They didn't have my bag on the site, but I reached out to them and asked them which one would, which insert would work for my bag. And they recommended this one for me. So, um, and it fits perfectly. This here is a pacifier sterilizer that I'm thinking about putting in here. I don't know. Like I'm trying not to put a bunch of like unnecessary stuff in here. So that may or may not go in. It just depends. I got this out because I was in here getting some stuff, but I need to put this back in my hospital bag with the rest of my hospital stuff here. I ordered a little portable diaper changing pad. I don't know if I'm going to use this though. Um, it's a little too bulky, but that's because you can like put your diapers and wipes in here as well. I found one on Instagram that's a little more compact that I ordered. That should be coming sometime this week. Um, so I'm going to compare the two before I like commit to this one. And what else? Pulled out the monitor because we need to get this set up. So I'm just gonna put that in his crib so dad can install and set that up for us. This is his little flathead pillow that we're just, we've decided that we're just gonna use this for the changing table. We're not going to use this in his crib or, or anywhere like that just to be safe. Um, this will just be for his changing table for now. And so got that. I need to transfer this aquaphor ointment to this little jar. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to transfer that over to this so that it looks just a little bit nicer. And then I am going to add hand sanitizer to this container here. Um, so we'll have that up here as well. And what else? That's it. So yeah, nothing much going on around here. Just all baby things. And I apologize if you guys are like not into this, but this is honestly where I am right now. Like, yeah, it's just all things baby. Oh, we also took the car seat slash stroller out of the box. And so this makes it like really real <laughs> because this has been in the box for a while. Um, but it does come with a seat protector, although we had seat protectors on our registry and um, one of my friends got it for us. So I think I'll use this one for my car and let PK use the other one for his car. The seat did come with um, a base, but we had to order a second one for um, PK's car. So he'll have one in his car and then I'll have one in mine. We'll be getting those installed this week actually. So yeah. Lots going on around here and just all exciting things.